Hey guys, welcome back to a new video and uh, today I want to talk about how you can go about getting your first client if you are uh, starting to design on Roblox. If you are new, I understand how difficult or it seems to be quite confusing as to how you can get clients and have the ball rolling and how to build your personal brand basically. So quick little backstory. I started out by making graphics for as cheap as like five bucks. Um, <laughs> I was making very simple ad designs and group logos. Um, but this was quite a long time ago. And, you know, of course, naturally, uh, as Roblox itself has progressed so far, the influx of revenue that these games are making uh, you could start off making a lot more than just five bucks. You can start off even as a beginner and make more than, you know, five bucks. But uh, first of all, I think the best thing you can do is to start posting actively on a platform like X uh, or you could say Twitter, because this is basically how you can have your own profile where people can see your work and come to you uh, because you don't really want to be approaching other people like a, a code call or like a code approach. But you might be asking, well, if I don't have any work to show, how can I post anything? Well, you don't actually have to post uh, commissions. You can post work that you just do for fun, right? And also pick your niche. What that means is, okay, if you are designing, there are uh, multiple categories of designing on Roblox. Uh, we have UIs, we have graphics, which is basically, uh, I would say, uh, that's mostly renders. And we have logos that can be game logos or group logos, which are more minimal. Usually uh, game logos are like the uh, 3D uh, drawn vector stuff. And then we have icons. Check out the new icon packs we have on our store, which you can get for your game. We have the food icon pack, currency icons pack, vector gift boxes icon pack, and much more coming soon. Check it out. Link is below or right on the screen. So you want to take a look at the um, other designers that you are basically going to be, uh, that are basically somewhat in your niche of choice. So if you're best at making UIs, you obviously want to market yourself as a UI designer. Making UIs and graphics or thumbnails is a vastly different process. With interfaces, if you enjoy something a little more, uh, UIs are a little more technical or at the highest level. Uh, not saying graphics aren't technical, but when you're making a thumbnail, the final result is an image, right? With a UI, it is the literal interface that people are going to be interacting with to access uh, gameplay features and stuff like that. So you can think of UI as like a bridge between the, um, the art, art side and the uh, logical side, which is the programming. How to price your own work. It is always best to start off with cheaper prices. This is not to undervalue your work, but if you are just starting, you want your prices cheap so you can get some momentum, right? You can get some clients and because you can always increase your prices later. In fact, that is always the best move. If I was just starting out, I would make an X account and I would start posting. I would recommend daily, uh, just one post per day and basically just start posting your work and also uh, i would make a commission sheet um, that, that will list your prices and i would pin that to the top of my page so every single work i make uh, if people click on my profile they can see that i am open for work um, you could also do things like make a uh, talent hub page on roblox's talent hub if you want but really there is no secret you simply have to find a platform, right? Create your your page and start building your brand. It is something that takes time 
and it ultimately will reflect your own growth. So the more you improve and get better as a designer, uh, your public profile or brand is going to reflect that as you keep posting and sharing. And eventually um, you'll get your first client. And uh, from there, we could make several more videos um, discussing the topic of uh, communication and how to handle clients, how to be, uh, how to conduct business basically. So if you guys want videos regarding that, uh, drop a comment down below because how you conduct your business is going to be, uh, very important because you can see, um, on a daily basis or quite frequently, there is a lot of miscommunication between clients and the uh, service providers or the freelancers no matter if it's design or modeling uh, it happens quite often so this is a bit of a different video i uh, hope you guys got some value from uh, this yeah if you watch the entire thing and listen to me ramble i am not the best speaker uh, i'm much better at writing things down but uh, anyways i hope you guys enjoy check out GFX Comet. You can get our new food icon pack. Uh, we have currency icon packs, uh, unlimited access. We have over 155 people uh, that have joined. So you could be next. Uh, anyways, yeah, we'll catch you guys next time.